What's up, y'all? So I I just came from work, and I have a bad news because when I checked RTs, I saw this. Molds. Okay, so let's get on making the new enclosure for the Posiliteria Metallica. So, children, please, if you want to make the same procedure, please be careful about using heated knives, alright? By the way guys, I have learned this technique from watching Schizoperma TV's vlogs. Now, this part is not clear. I don't like the looks of this. So I want to cut this area and I'm gonna put a clear sheet here. We have to glue this base here. Alright, we have ourselves a front opening enclosure. I'm only gonna put side ventilations for this setup. Everything is all tight, I've washed them. Opening is so good. Okay, and it comes back tight. All right. Now, the problem last time, I was using a fig tree branch. And uh, after some time that the water remains on the enclosure, mold starts to generate. And I want to avoid that now, so I'm just gonna use fake plants. These Posalitaria metallica are arboreal species. Now let's go in and fill this up with substrate. See, I am using a dry substrate. 50% of cocoa fiber and potting soil. Now, let's go on and put them inside. All right, let's go on with rehousing this Posiliteria Metallica Communal catch 
catch bottle, catch cup, tweezers, chopsticks. All right, first let's go and check what happened to this enclosure, you see? There's a lot of moles coming here. And also on that part. It's a good thing the pokies stay here and not near this mold. But we have to evacuate them now. Okay, let's start with rehousing these guys. So guys, here they are after the rehouse. One of them is here. All right. And the other two are there. So I hope they would like this setup. All right, so guys, that wraps up for tonight's video. And I really hope you have learned a lot from my mistakes as a newbie, as an amateur keeper. And I'm hoping to see you on the next video. Good night, God bless.